Um, now, Nads, you shared something on your social media this morning that kind of resonated with all of us, didn't you? Well, I did. It was this lovely thing that popped up, and it <laughs> wasn't lovely, actually. It was this poor mum who was sleeping in a cot. Oh, you can see it there. And, look, it just shows how oh, the yeah. baby's just moving all over and she's <laughs> desperate for the sleep. So I just posted that this morning, saying, any new mums, I promise you this gets better. You know, they do sleep. <laughs> But it also just made me feel sort of sad for that thing that they're not in my bed anymore, even though they're 19 oh. and 15. And I said to my... <laughs> I know, I said to my youngest the other day, I was giving her a, a hug and then I just went up and a bit more and I was just, like, sniffing her neck, you know? I went a bit... Test and I went, oh, it'd be so nice if you just slept with me sometimes, just got in my bed. And she said, Mum, I really would. And I was like, oh, she went... It's the snoring. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, so if I wasn't snoring, would you get in the bed? She, Sometimes I really want to just get in and have oh. that cuddle. It oh. is lovely, isn't it? So now I'm booking in for some sort of operation. I don't know what it is I need, <laughs> but I'm having the operation. There is that point, isn't there, where that you can still cuddle them at home, but then you, you take them to school and they're literally mm -hmm. like, don't even come anywhere near I had me. that for the first time the other oh. day, Parker, my eldest. Normally I'll like give him a cuddle right where I drop him off and I'm like, bye, love you, love you, love you, bye, have a good day. And he's like, mm. and he literally took a step back the other day oh. and made me like drop him off like further back and went, <laughs> mummy, I'll cuddle you now. And I was like, oh, okay. And he gave me a cuddle and then he just went off and I was like, oh, oh. <laughs> it started. And it's only nine in October. Is I'm that like, that's it. Oh, there's but... that beautiful poem about you'll pick them up and it, you won't know when it's the last time. You're oh, oh, you won't know when it's the last that time. That's too and much. It's like, oh, it's... But you say that he doesn't want anything to do with you outside school, but let's yeah. talk about the bedroom. Yes. So, yeah, they both still sleep in my bed and the two dogs. Uh, why would um... you do that? Why? <laughs> because I love it, Judy. <laughs> so, like, I literally... Oh, yeah, so, so that's we can just see, normal... this is the That's the old bed. Yes. Right? So, like, yeah. Tell us about the new bed. So, I've now got a new bed that has, like... You know where, like, normally you'd have drawers under the bed mm. to, like, put stuff in? Mine um, pulls out and they're mattresses ah. at the side <laughs> of my bed so that we can all sleep together Why? <laughs> I love it, Judy! I stayed... I was working late last night and then I was here early this morning, so I stayed in a hotel last night and I had to put pillows all around me so that I didn't... I felt so lonely, cos yeah. normally I've got a dog here, I've got a foot here somewhere, and I just love it. And one day they're I know not the boys on there is always weighing on them with it's the dogs. It's normally Wayne, to be fair. <laughs> you, do, you do know there will be a time when it will just be you and Wayne, don't you? Oh, God! <laughs> what will we do? <laughs> a lot. <laughs> <laughs> What about, what about your two? <laughs> Do you know what, my two, she's like 17, so she's very like, oh, God, right. Like, I hug her and she's literally like, oh, get off me. Like, <laughs> so stiff. Like, my breath smell, what's wrong <laughs> with you? Like, just hug your mama. But I, I do the same for you too. I want to smell a little neck and I remember yeah. just a little baby. And my son, he's kind of get that stage. And sometimes he's like, oh, mama, I'll come home from like a late night and he's in my bed. And I'm like, oh, oh. get out. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> get out. Oh, yeah. Get out. And then, I, and then a few days later, I kind of regret it because they sleep awkward. I, I they do. do I, yeah. I want to give them cuddles, and I wish they'd just cuddle me a bit more. But I, I do like my bed space for my. I don't understand. Eyes. I mean, that you know, yours are older now, but I don't understand the obsession that some people have about getting their kids out of the bed, the bed early. It's more often the man. I do think, mm. you know, yeah. yeah, but I we, do we think... We would keep them longer. At some point, they are going to just push away from you. Mm. So, like, love it. I just love to have got in bed with my mum and dad more. Like, I used yeah, to come in in yeah. the morning, that would be, like, the first thing we would do. But, like, I don't know, I think, like, if you have a partner, we sleep with our partners, but why do we expect our children to sleep alone? Oh, because no. we yeah. don't. But there's I nothing I better than it. there's nothing better than when you get that little cuddle oh. from and they've got yeah. their little hands oh, yeah. tucked away in your belly grease. Yeah, but you're chucking them out because <laughs> you can. <laughs> uh... When they get their hands stuck. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like when it's stuck on top. Sometimes I do it on purpose. When they're trying to pull away, I just clamp down like that. <laughs> Right, 